What's up, y'all? This is Sean Thomas. We're getting ready for our second steel pan evolution workshop. Uh, this is happening down at the Lillian Bryant Community Center, Ocala, Florida. So we're getting ready. We have our setup. You see here, we have our tambu bamboo. All right, and we have some tools here. Of course, the garbage can, whatever people would get their hands on for carnival when they uh, took away the drum, metal instruments came in. So bottle and spoon, of course, the, you have the uh, pot, garbage can covers and stuff. Here you have steel pan sticks, you know, double second sticks, guitar pan sticks. You have these balls here that we use. We cut them and we make base sticks. I'll show you that in a little bit. But this is the space. This is the Ocala Steel Orchestra. And this is in the Lillian Bryan Community Center. You see that? Those faces up there, our board of directors. Right, CEO and musical director we have on the wall as well. One of the first ladies to play the steel pan, Rufina Thomas Thompson, her son next to her. Leroy Thomas, who made all the instruments, and of course, his cousin who wrote the book, Pan Rigger. So we have our double seconds, triple cellos. We have our six bass, tenor bass, another six bass, another pair of cellos, and we have our guitar pans. And of course, we're including some bucket drumming, percussion. All right, peace out. Take care, folks. Bye for now.